Would a, would a referendum on Europe be a public vote on the, uh, re the legal system of the European community and the Human Rights Act, do you mean? Yeah, only in part, I think. Um, but it may be in significant part, and if so, uh, to a, a significant stent, extent, possibly um, a vote by way of misunderstanding. I sense at the moment that the tide is perhaps moving back in favour of the Human Rights Act, but I could be entirely wrong. And it may be that more and more people will take the right-wing view that we should be free of this, the shackles of the European community in every single way that it does control us. Recent events in Greece may make that uh, a highly attractive position for people to argue about. And they can always turn to individual cases under the human rights legislation of Europe, as well as our own to say that this law has gone too far. Um, I think it'll be extremely unfortunate if that happens. Um, uh, it's true, people are at least understanding that the Human Rights Act was, the Human Rights Convention, the European Human Rights Convention was largely drafted by senior English lawyers. That doesn't make it any better or any worse, but it does make it slightly surprising that England should now be seeking to run away from laws that its own and very illustrious legal forebears thought should be enacted for everyone's general good. And so, yes, I think the referendum, if and when it comes, or do I have to say when it comes, will reflect quite a lot on the public conception or misconception of the way human rights law has operated from Europe.